blah, 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 blah. Why not? Let's hope I didn't break it. Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be doing a haul of everything that I have bought to take with me to Cambridge Uni. So I've been preparing over the past few weeks, buying lots of different bits and pieces from different shops. Thought I'd show you it all and let's get going. So the first thing that I've got to show you guys is this Wilco Super Soft Throw. It's pink, it's really, really soft. Like, I could sit here and cuddle this for a very long time. <laughs> I love it and it's going to go over my bed. It's going to keep me warm in the cold Cambridge winters. And yeah, looking forward to using it. Now I found out a few weeks ago that I'm going to be getting an ensuite, which I am very happy about because I'm quite high maintenance, like I feel like I wouldn't have liked to share a bathroom in my first year. So I know people do and people say it's fine and I'm going to have to in later years, but for first year it's quite nice to have an ensuite. So I've got two essentials for an ensuite bathroom. First one being a pedal bin. It's black. Pretty standard. It's again from Wilco. It was pretty cheap. Like, I can't remember the exact price, but no more than a fiver. So I thought, why not? It's gonna sit in my bathroom because it's black, it will go with everything. So if I have like bright red and yellow spotty tiles, no issue. We've got a black bin. And even more exciting, wait for it, to match is a toilet brush and holder. And matches my bin, sit in my bathroom. And here's the lid, Put the lid on top. Not much more to say about that. Although I feel, actually, I don't feel like it's the lid. I feel like the brush sticks through this. Does it? Whoops. Does it go like that? And then you have your handle there and you stick it back in the bin. I feel like it does. We'll figure it out. We'll figure out how it works, you see. <laughs> Life experiences. So the next thing is also keeping with the bathroom theme. And it's from Primark. And it is this luxurious Primark memory foam bath mat. Yeah, it's memory foam, so I know my feet are going to be extremely comfy and well looked after because I do have very sensitive feet. And yeah, baby pink, which will match my bath towels, which I'm taking from home, which are also pink. And yeah, it was only £6, so bargain. Yeah, it's got like a little design. Would recommend, would recommend. So next, also from Primark Home, for 250, yes, you heard me, 250. I got some two like door hook things. No idea if they're gonna fit the doors that I have. Absolutely no clue how big my doors are gonna be. But I thought for 250, you can't really go wrong. And I do like something to hang my dressing gown on. And so you know, I thought, why not splurge? We'll risk it. I will make them fit. And if they don't fit on my door there, I will give them to someone else who has a door that can fit them because I think they are well cute. So they're like kind of copper coated with little white bits at the end of the hooks. And I thought, good value. You get two hooks in one. What more could you want? So excited to use those the next thing is a mug because i want a really cool mug collection i know it sounds sad but i want like my mum was going don't you want a set but i really don't i want loads of mismatched ones and just ones that kind of represent me because a lot of my mugs have smashed at home so i'm thinking let's get some new ones so this one was 250 from primark it's Winnie the Pooh, I love Winnie the Pooh. Piglet is my favourite character, although this isn't a piglet mug. We've still got to invest in one of those. If, if, you know, if you know where a piglet mug is, hit me up because I need one. It says, I'd rather be in bed 
and it's got Winnie the Pooh kind of on his back sleeping I suppose and do you know it's gonna be true when I'm having like my morning coffee it's gonna be like I'd rather be in bed and everyone's everyone's gonna know to steer clear it is the first of a collection that I'm sure is going to grow and grow I've just seen coming out in Primark the chip mugs like they've got the new Beauty and the Beast range and I'm like Damn it, I should have waited. I should have got that bedding. But oh well, I'm gonna get one of the chip mugs to go with this as well. So watch out for it in a vlog because it will be featuring. I also need to get a new Wimbledon mug because my mum broke mine. Sad times. See, I don't know how many mugs I need actually. I feel like I feel like maybe <laughs> two or three might be enough. I don't know. We'll see. I wanna get a mug tree and everything. Well, I don't know where I'd keep it. People probably steal my mugs. <laughs> Woo! Not the most exciting one, I must say, but it's a filing tray. It's grey. And what's even more exciting, I got two of them. They do fit on top of each other. Let me just, okay, there we go. I'm just gonna put papers on there. It's probably gonna sit on my desk. I just feel like it's gonna help organize me. This is gonna help sort my life out. But this is one of the, I think this is the most exciting thing. I've said that about almost everything, but I genuinely mean it this time. It is my bed linen. Yeah, I've got from the range a pillowcase and duvet cover. It's feather watercolour purple. Here's like the back picture. It's got feathers on it. Um, pink and purple, because I like pink. I like a little purple. I thought, let's not go all pink. Let's bring in some mainly white. I'm gonna hope I don't get it too dirty. We'll see how it goes. But the beauty of it is, is it's it only it might have been like nine pounds for this set. And I've got I've got two of these. There's another one down there. If I really hate it after the first term, I can just buy some new bed linen because it's you know for nine pounds. I searched for this bedding. For quite a while, I looked all the way around Dunelm Mill, saw nothing, and I was like, we need to go elsewhere. So we went to the range, found this one, and I'm excited to use it. And technically, people often won't buy a new one of these for uni, but I just wanted one, so <laughs> I bought one. A dressing gown. Okay, right, I'm going to put it on and model it. And... Here we go. It's got like a rose kind of imprint on it. I don't know if you can, can you see there? It's like a baby pink. Literally, you, you don't even understand how soft it is. I literally feel like I could curl up right here, go to sleep. I'm probably gonna live in this. Like I'll be studying, like just in my dressing gown like all the time. I wanna be able to go to the kitchen and not get like judgmental looks from people like what dressing gown is that? It was quite pricey, but I thought, why not treat myself? It was from, uh, I don't know how you supposed to say it, like Boo Avenue, Bow Avenue? I don't know, but you know the one. It was originally 45 pounds, and you might think, oh my God, that's quite a lot. Well, I mean, I would anyway, but I got 20% off that, so. Actually, okay, no, that's still quite expensive, but oh well, I love it, so let's not think about the price. Right, so next thing I bought is this exciting thing. You're probably thinking, what the hell is this? It's like a buildable laundry bin. So you've got a little lid, and yeah, I could just shove my laundry in here. It's probably gonna be getting quite full, cause you know, I'm probably not gonna be the greatest with doing all my laundry, but you know, very exciting. Quite liked the colour scheme, blue and white stripe, also from Wilco, cause love me a bit of Wilco. It was pretty reasonably priced, as you'd expect from Wilco. And yeah, little handle, gonna be useful to take with me. Right, now I have to figure out how to put it down again. Back of the mo. Next thing is something I've wanted for literally ages, just at home in my room. So I thought going to uni is the perfect excuse to get it. 
if I'd known it was this cheap before from Wilco, I would have got one. It is a crystal mirror bathroom bling. So no, it's one of those like magnifying round ones. I feel like it's such an essential. It's gonna make me do my makeup so much easier. <laughs> See, this is what I'm dealing with with filming at the moment. Books. Yeah, actually quite exciting. And look at this lovely, you know, <laughs> tacky detailing. <laughs> love that, love that. So I'm probably gonna like sit this on the side in my bedroom. I've been keeping it all in boxes because it's easier to move when we are making our way to Cambridge. Exciting times. So thank you guys for watching my video today. I really appreciate it. If you could let me know, comment down below anything else that you might think might be useful to take to uni. I am catered so I don't need a lot of kitchen stuff but any other essentials that you think I might need to remember to get or bring along with me, let me know. I'd really appreciate it because I literally have no idea. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you next video. Bye.